Alrighty, back into Dull Dragon. And what's it called? Daldrasis. So what are we doing? I can potentially maybe pick up some more quests now. Now I just gotta remember where they are. I could we got the one at the top so I don't have to go up there anymore. But there was some further down. In here, right? There's one. I don't think I've actually gone in here. Like, I started running in and then I realized my quest log was full. It's training dummies in here. Let's talk to this guy. Militia Scourge of the Flightless. You can't fly? Oh, it's you. Hello, mortal. Proving in skirmishes. Till we meet again. You're confident in your tactical abilities, eh? I'm told that small-scale skirmishes occur among you mortals. Go off and go off and some rivals to match up against. Hmm. Let us see what you can prove, then return to me. Obtain honor from arena skirmishes. Skirmishes, eh? We'll do that later. Out there. You'll need it. Can you even earn honor now, or do you have to wait for the season to start? I don't know. Let's go. <laughs> That's right. These um, archives, there was a quest. From this guy. Hey, Theldron. What do you seek? Relic recovery, legacy of Tyr. Kimura has been having me search for any reference to keep a Tyr and Elderman that exists. My paper cuts have pa my paper cuts have paper cuts with all the books I've had to go through trying to find what she's looking for. Almost all mentions are torn away or destroyed, aside from this one that I set aside to show her later. Apparently there is something precious in Alderman that has been hidden away. I would be very interested in having you bring it to me so that I may ke help Kimura in her research, of course. Obtain the Hourglass of Shifting Sands from Chrono Lord Deos in Alderman. And I will be able to get some reps. Okay. Stay vigilant. Cool. Why are you green, Alma? Wait, all of them are green. You just look different because they have question marks above their head. <laughs> Okay, well, there was another quest down with all the artisans, right? Where am I? Up here. Oh wait, we better go over that direction. Wait, how do I get there? This road. Oops. Somewhere here. What is this building? Dark Talons. Innkeeper. What is this place? Zuri! I wondered if I'd recognize you in your visage. But somehow I just knew it was you. I felt the same sensation. Your visage suits you well, my friend. It does, doesn't it? Evisian said to look inside and let the magic within express how I wanted to be seen. <laughs> I guess the old dragon was right after all. His visage is that of a... Torin. Correct. Hey. And it seems many dragons oh, yeah. take Abyssian. the form of elves. I confess I am still learning the difference between them. I hear some dragons even choose to look like gnomes. Whatever that is. Rathian could not tell me why our visages are so distinctive. Perhaps ours were meant for a different purpose. All I know is that I like what I see in myself and in you. Are you Drakthia? Dark Talons, Obsidian Waters. Oh, it's Cinder Thresh. Oh, what the heck? I, I didn't even realize. I just read Scale Commander. Wow, okay. You call that a uniform? This place is great. I'm glad we managed to secure some space given how crowded our dragon is getting. The dragons will need to acknowledge our kind and our contributions. 
probably a good thing in probably a good thing Sar Sarkareth is not here. He would be livid and probably demand one of the big dragon roost towers. Now, if I could just find where Viridia went. How have you been adapting to the world? The Horde has turned out to be a collection of undisciplined misfits and outcasts all held together with a loose desire to be better people and honor. I love it. Also, look at this visage. Look at these legs, this face. Magical. Naltharian had mentioned it might be something we would try eventually, but he never really elaborated on limitations. Huh, okay. Um, what do you think about Naltharian? Naltharian? Well, I hear they started calling him Deathwing before he died, and he earned the title. I'm proud of what my Wern is capable of doing and achieving, but I'm terrified to think of what he might have asked us to do had he started using us in the field. True. Well, that's something he probably training. had like the foresight to sh to lock you away because of that. And Azrathel, how is the alliance going? Respect must be earned. How have you been adapting to the world? I would say this world is more populated than I was expecting. The alliance does not have enough order and discipline for my tastes, but they'd show promise and mean well. Given time, we might mold them into a more unified and dignified fighting force. Okay. And what do you think about Naltharian? Naltharian, I would counter with another question. Does it matter what I think? He is dead. <laughs> I am told that before he died, he did a great many evil deeds, became corrupted by old gods, and his children and flight made war on this world, the likes of which led to a cataclysm. To me, he was a father and a leader. To everyone else, a murderer and world breaker. I will choose to remember him my way. Yeah, fair enough. I mean, you knew him, and then you got sealed away, and that's all you knew. Um, what if the Horde Alliance go to war again? Huh, well, then allow me to congratulate you in advance. I'm sure your forces will appreciate losing to only the best. <laughs> Fair enough. The Obsidian Warders stand proud. So you, Drakteer, have your own cool little, um, alcove over here, huh? That's nice. And it's got weird glittery stuff falling from the ceiling. Fishmonger! Hey, lead titan researcher Sorotus. What is your gigantic is glowy orb? The search for titan relics. It is a world of wonders. I have spent all of my time since the waking, since the waking studying the titans. Their history is fascinating. What power they must have wielded to create the dragon flights. There is so much knowledge to be gained about them. If you could bring me any Titan relics you find around the Dragon Isles, I'll put in a good word for you within the Valdraken Accord. Okay, unlock the ability to identify Titan relics. Thanks. Be bold. And a Titan relic. Have you found a Titan relic? Uh, apparently, I have. Farewell. Amazing. This relic is perfectly preserved. I will begin studying it right away. Your efforts are most appreciated. I will remember my promise to speak well of you to the Valdraken Accord. Now, where was I? Yes, this will fit in right over here. May we all find what we seek. Cool. And who? Why is this? A, is this a? It's a guy from. Oh man, Bald Baldun. What are they called? The Snake People. The keepers gave us thought. Shaman, I know someone who is in dire need of your skills. Tearhold Reservoir has just been attacked by Primalus. I was lucky to make my escape when I did. I fear the others may not be so lucky. It is just to the north of here. Find Zatiki and she'll be able to fill you in on the details. If she's still alive, that is. Okay. Farewell. Are you... What are these... I forget what these snake people are called. Um, let me see. Uh... Sethrilis, that's what it is. The Sethrak. Man, that would have been cool if these guys joined the Horde instead of the Volpera. They just look awesome. Is it a Sethrak? Is that what I'm thinking? It looks, sure looks like one. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, what, what next? What next? Oh wait, there's another quest down in the... Hmm? What's the healing wings? What's this place? Is this for like healing Drakthia? Dr. Oven. <laughs> Oven? Oven? Who are you guys? Who are you, Kadefi? I am thinking. You tell me to shush? You shush. <laughs> the vast amount of knowledge here. I read every volume of history, lit history, literature and love and lore we had back in the war crash, and even some of the library of the healing wings and even scales. I thought that was a lot of knowledge. Here, here there is so much to catch up on, so many new voices being captured with the written word. How have you been adopting to the world? Adapting. Initially, I was ecstatic to witness so many places I have only read about. Now, I have become quite frustrated with how much has changed from my studies. I study so much and all of it is out of date by multiple epochs of this world. <laughs> Fair enough. What do you think about Natharian? In hindsight, the signs were there. We were too close to see them. We knew only a few dragons and all of them loyal to Natharian. I have seen the evidence, read testimonials, spoken with some who were there and saw his fall. It is all logical. So why do I feel so betrayed? Fair skies and strong winds to you. Hello, Trenosh. The aspects have returned. Um, this place has changed. The buildings are the same, but the people, the dragons. How have you been adapting to the world? Too many think they know my kind. What few remain of my kind have forgotten who we were and what we used to stand for. In many ways, my small brigade, my small brigade is is, a, is as out of time as the Drakthia. Um, why are you with the Healing Wings? The Healing Wings showed my troops mercy when we offered them arms. Of all those we have met since waking up, I find Viridia and her Wern to be the most worthy of our dedication. Wait, 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 this is part of the Drakthia starting campaign, right? I remember these guys, yeah. This was in the poison area and we, um, we saved these guys. I know of no life beyond, beyond service to a worthy leader. With Malagas gone, Viridia has proven to be the axis upon which my ideology has pivoted. She is more worthy than she will admit, and her cause is more just than I could have imagined. So if Malagas is gone, why didn't you just align with Calagos? Uh, I don't know. What do you think of Malagos? Deathwing stunned my aspect. They were friends, and the worm shattered the blue dragonfly with the wave of its claw. Were he not already dead, I would march every soldier I could muster on the lair of Deathwing and bring back bring back his head. But we missed that. Lies in misfortune see my small brigade trapped eons after we agreed to sleep and watch the Drakthia. My aspect is dead. Well, no, Caligos is here. Isn't that your aspect? Oh, I don't know. Few now remember what he stood for in life. The only they only remember the horrors of Malagos unleashed before he had to be defeated. Hmm. Glory to all dragons. And Vridia, how has your healing been going? I should actually How can I help? Do a resto spec off, hey. This city is so decadent. Since the Forbidden Reach, I have seen so much pain and suffering in the landscape, and here stands a testament to the power of dragons and a reminder of how little they used to how little they used it to aid others before now. <laughs> uh what do you think about Natharian? Natharian made us. What is more, he made us to help him with the task he could not do himself. That is how I will choose to remember him. I will continue to bring mercy and healing to those who need it and help heal this world of its woes. I will continue to help mend the scars left behind by Natharian, both from his time as Deathwing and before. And I will do this not because he made me do it, but because I choose to do this. It is the right thing to do, and someone must choose healing over war. Um... Where are the rest of the Healing Wings? Currently they are dispersed throughout the Dragon Isles, helping where they can. Eventually we will have enough resources and knowledge to mount an expedition back to the Forbidden Reach, to recover those who are still trapped in stasis within the crèche there. For now we will wait, we wait, we heal, and help, and gather our strength. Um, and how have you been adapting to the world? Life moves at a different pace now. Everywhere we went, there were those in need, those who needed healing or a reprieve. I continued to help as best I could, but worried with every step that I was forcing my wern down a path of service they should not have to be subjected to. I tried to disband my wern three times, as a matter of fact, 
Most refused. I insisted we had free will, and they should feel free to pursue their own goals and dreams. Too many continued to follow me, <laughs> so I stopped asking for them to leave and started giving them orders on how best to use their skills for good. I yeah. hope for your quick return. Cool. Well, it's interesting, you guys. Yeah, I just want to quickly look at a resto spec. Now that we've got more talent points. Hmm. So this was called Chabo Resto 1. And now I have 5 points in each tree. What is worth getting? Oh, I, I want Gus to win for sure. Uh, wins Alakia, we need to get that right. When you have three or more totems active, your movement speed is increased by 8%. Gus to win, please. Oh, wait, I need to take Swirling Currents now, don't I? Because I don't have the conduit anymore. Um. Mm. There's probably stuff I can toss out. Figure that out later. Um, what should I go with over here? When you critically heal with your healing wave, healing surge or riptide, you summon an ancestral spirit to aid you, instantly healing the lowest percentage health. So if you crit, heal someone, you heal someone else that's low, okay. Hmm. Increases the duration of Riptide by three seconds. Riptide. Let's take Earth Living Weapon. Increase the healing Earth Living by 50%. What's down here? Wellspring and Deeply Rooted Elements. Casting Reptile has a 7% chance to activate Ascendance. Huh, interesting. Each Riptide you cast on a Riptide active. Okay, it's. Hmm. Let's take this and let's take deeply rooted elements. I don't really know what I'm doing here. <laughs> I can take a second point here in this torrent. <laughs> I'm just going to apply that. That's such a strange build. I probably need to look into this better. Mm. Anyway, let's go back to elemental while I level. That's right, there's a quest down here next to these... um. I swear someone down here had a quest. Hey, here's the enchanting trainer. I walked past him before. No, did I never come down here? I don't think I did. Or did I? Oh, there's a quest over here. I should go talk to that enchanting trainer, though. Who are you, Grim, 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 Grimla Fizzlecrank from the Venture Co? Hey, did you come from, like, um, Ratchet or something? Hey, or? how you doing? Or Booty Bay? Lost to the skies. I need a favor, and you look like the favor doing type. An old pal of mine, Harleen Chirpensnide, 
was supposed to meet me in a city in the city a few days ago. We was planning to eat our way through the Ruby Feast, get a trim at the barbershop, and then go visit the swanky auction house they got over here. But she ain't showing up. She gets lost in her work plenty, but I, I feel a lot more comfortable knowing she was here. Try the mountain south of here. She mentioned she'd be swinging by on her way in. Okay. Have a good one. Can do. What are you looking at? The moon? Welcome to the Dragon Isles. Hello, friend. Did you also get turned... Okay. Another one of these guys. Turned away Die from your home. Chaos. Uh, who's Renker? Need something. The denizens of the Onaran Plains have honed their nomadic lifestyle for countless generations. Think of what the Valpera could learn from them. Be quick. Indeed, Be think. Clever. Zora? Talk to me. This is far from the mainland. The war feels like a distant memory. Tinsy and Tavros be good people in the end. That, that all that be all that matters. Spirits be with your man. Hmm. And Kida. Kenai Valindra. There are so many people, different characters to meet. Had the Kaldori never ventured beyond the bows of our sacred forests, we would never have set foot in this wondrous place. Farewell. Indeed. Jaytong from Pandaria. Greetings. Generations spent hidden from the rest of Azeroth, only to discover a world of splendor in the lands beyond. To think we three would have so much in common. Who, what do you May have in common with Kida? From what I understand, we are not the first people to emerge from our solitude into an unfamiliar world. Times are changing in the Dragon Isles. I can only hope we are able to adapt as those before have done. Oh, you were one of those um, people in the chaos. Forbidden Reach. Hmm. Sommelier? What, what is a sommelier? Our flight has much you sell to wine. Okay. I will see you again. Um, let's go, yeah, let's go check this enchanting trainer out anyway. This guy? This guy. My wares were made I need to be knowledge. enchanting 50. No. Why does the top one say 50, but the ones below the 35? Why is the order like that? And these ones say 30 down here. Hmm. Come see me again. What is my enchanting? 27. Oh, because I need to do more enchants on stuff. What's my risk got on it, Leech? Excuse me. Um... Hmm. Tailoring? Who else is down here? Proprietor? What do you sell? Oh, you sell random things. Okay. Well. Hey, this guy's got... Now, what is that mount? That looks like something from Drana. What is this thing, actually? Cliffside Wilderdrake. What? What the hell's a Wilder Drake? Hmm. What's in here? Have I been here? No. The Victorious Visage. Proprietor? Salon Consultant? Oh, it's a barber shop. It's a Visager. Okay. Interesting. What's with these portraits? Who are these guys? Hmm. More people. Is this because it's a barber shop and you can like, hey, I want to look like that? Interesting. Okay, let's head up. There's a quest up here I still gotta get. I wonder if my log's gonna be full. Crafting order people. Oh, that's right, there's a bench. Where's this guy? Here somewhere. There he is. Hey, it's Thomas Bright, man. I just I just left you in an iron plains on that cliff. And the girl's got a quest too. Hey there. Okay. Hey there. Um show your medal. Have a good one. Hey there, Chabo. The Artisans Consortium would like to thank you for everything you've done for us. We'd like to give you some artisans medal for free. Or free of charge. Maybe use it to fill some crafting orders for us. Okay. See you later. This artisan's medal, is it like a thing that's in my bag? Or is it a currency? What is this artisan's medal? Shadowlands, player vs player. 
I don't know what Artisan's Medal really well is. Met. A finishing touch. Ah, uh, Chabo, good to see you. You've been an exceptional help for the Artisan's Consortium, and to Thomas and myself personally, thank you. There is one more thing you should know as a crafter, and that that's building a rapport with your clients. I filled a crafting order for a customer today. Could you talk to him for me? Try to convince him to come to me for his future crafting needs. Remind him that he needs to come to me personally if he needs high quality goods. Convince Miguel's customers to entrust him with future crafting orders. Okay, and then I'll get some stuff. Go with our friend. Who do I need to talk to? You can probably find Jimothy browsing shops on the lower level. Put in a good word for me. You said on the lower level. Wait, wait, what did I just cast? Oh, I just cast Promoted Wave. Whoops. <laughs> Where's Jimothy? Uh, where is this guy? He said low level, but, but like... Let's just go down here. Wait, here he is. Indeed, he is down on the low level. Here he is, Jimothy Lewis. Yo, Jimothy. You are... Yes, Miguel Bright fill, filled a crafting order for you that you placed. Ah yes, yes he did. I put out my request as a public order and he happened to pick it up. So what? He would be happy to personally fill more orders. You should send him personal orders if you need anything future. Oh, he would be happy there, do that one. Is that so? And why should I trust him? Why not just place a public crafting order? Um, his prices are reliable, his responses are reliable. Let's go with that. While I dislike waiting on the caprice and vagaries of public orders, I very much doubt that he would answer my beck and call night and day. He has a life too, you know. Try to convince him further. Um, why would, why not just place it public? Um, his prices are reliable? I do appreciate reliability, but why him? His prices are no better than anyone else's. Um, uh, <laughs> what else do you have to say about Miguel? Um, and Miguel is handsome. <laughs> uh, he'll give you a better price. Hmm. Should I, am I lying by saying that? Let's click that. Better prices. As much as I would love to believe that, I just don't think it's true. At least I can't guarantee it. As nice as the man seems. Um, how about would you say Miguel is handsome? <laughs> well, I do not disagree with you. <laughs> there is more business... There's more to a business relationship than finding one's partner attractive. Um, how about you could make friends with him? Befriend my craftsman? Well, it's not the most, most outrageous suggestion anyone has ever provided. Yes, I suppose I could send him the occasional mail. Perhaps invite him to my next adventure. Should my guild find themselves absent an ally? I'm intrigued. If you have more to say about my partnership, try to convince him further. Hmm. Uh... You could ask for minimum order qual minimum quality with personal crafting orders. I can? Well now, why don't you just start with that? Being able to demand high quality goods that gives me such power. And here I was begging crafters in my remarks to please craft my item well, when I could simply ask someone directly to craft the quality I need. Alright, you've convinced me. I shall send my crafting orders directly to Mr. Bright from now on. Farewell. Awesome. Um... Back to Miguel then. Hey Miguel. King's honor, friend. Um, I'll tell you what Miguel, what Jimothy said. Wonderful. You know, Chabo, there's a secret to how I am able to make such high quality items for my customers with consistency, and for your efforts, I will share this knowledge with you. The trick to high quality craftsmanship is using finishing reagents. When I need to make something exceptional, I use my finishing reagents to aid my skill in crafting. Of course, in most cases, you need to specialize to use them. Here, I have some extras. Please take them as a token of my gratitude. 
Um, Life bless you. Okay, I can choose a reward. I can take either. Uh, good quality, tethered wise. When crafting precise cuts, ensure perfect proportions with nothing going to waste. Gain 10 resources, 100 resources to this recipe. So I'm going to choose fish, finishing crafting reagent for usable with dragon isles recipes. Break into five less illustrious inside. Um, okay, let's take this engineering thing. That sounds good. Be careful. Thanks, McGill. Um, what now? That's all the quests, right, that I could pick up. I need to go... Hey, these spas. Yeah, relaxation time. Oh, wait. I need to remember to catch that fish, right? Yep, I need to remember that. Okay, let's head up to this relaxation time. And see what's up over there. What's the best way to get there? I'm just going to kind of follow the mini-map. Up the stairs. Hey, I never put... Oh, wait. Because I switched to Resto, it dropped my um, lighting shield, didn't it? But I still got Flame Tongue on my weapon, surprisingly. That's interesting. Okay, where should I wait, how should I get to that place? Uh, if I go left here and then right at the archives. Hmm. <coughs> Damn it. <coughs> I did not swallow right. Damn. Okay, it's the archives. Look at these white trees. Wow, that's a cool looking tree. What is this building? Looks like gem eggs? What is this guy? Oh dear, yeah, can't talk to them. And this building? What's up here? Nothing. Are the spas up or down? I'm gonna guess down. Yep. Ruby Enclave. Is that where the spar is down there? It does look like it. The Aqueduct Basin. I just saw a fishing icon. <laughs> Is there a fishing icon? Can I fish in the spa? I thought this was going to be like hot springs or something. Or nonsense. What's um... Steel cliff rampart. Wow, where are these um... How far down is this this place? What is this? Tour. Okay. What's it say? Northwatch Tower? Spa opening postpone. Wait, the spa is this way? <laughs> okay. What's over here though? I'm gonna go to the spa in a sec. I don't know, let's just go to the spa. I thought there might be something over there to talk to. Whoa! <laughs> I just ran off the edge.
why does it say the opening's postponed? Does that mean there's gonna be like mobs here we gotta deal with? Hey, purple, pl purple plant. Hey, mallards or waterfowls. Duckling. Okay, this seems to be the place. Is there a queue? What is going on here? Resentful spa patron. <laughs> what is going on? Hey, why do you say welcome? Hmm. Tell me of your travels. How delightful! I'm so glad you're joining us. However, we could really use your some help. What is up? I hope to see you again soon. Welcome to the Serene Dream Spa. I must apologize, we are not able to admit new guests at this time due to circumstances beyond our control. Let me refer you to the spa manager, Jean Thompor. He is qualified to answer all your questions. Speak with the spa manager. Travel safe. Who's the manager? Oh, the guy over there. Wow, this, the queue keeps going inside. Hey, manager guy. Hello. Um. While we deal with the scheduling issues caused by a small elemental problem, I recommend keeping your relaxation limited to the VIP island. How long have you been manager at this spa? How kind of you to ask about me. I have been serving the needs of others non-stop, so it's nice to take a moment and tell someone my story. Though it's actually quite short. Quillius contacted me barely a week ago, oh this guy, um, to develop this spa into something that everyone can enjoy. Relaxation is not only for our winged patrons. It seems it may seem like the gliders you go Yuga classes and musicians have all failed, but I'm op optimistic that once everything comes together, the Serene Dream Spa will obtain the best reviews. Well good luck. Jade Serpent um, guide you. Oh, you're here to help? I would be honored to have your assistance. There is no hurry. The you Gar class. The mist protect Everything was going so well, but now elementals are causing some um, mild challenges. Our guests were enjoying the facilities when suddenly all these elementals appeared. Those nasty fiends have disrupted everything. Probably even the new Yugar instructor. Oh yes, Yugar <laughs> is a new type of stretching that helps you meditate at the same time. I am sure both teacher and students are so relaxed they do not even notice the elementals. Still. Better to be safe than sorry. Please look for them. Okay, find the instructor and the six you guys. Next students. one is on me. And manager's manager? <laughs> All paths begin uh, in a dream. So you're the manager's manager? Since the Serene Dream Spa is an offshoot of the city, I wanted to ensure that someone local was at their home, hence my position. But I consider Jan and myself equal partners. In this, his experience is, in, is invaluable. Also, you cannot make others happy unless you understand diverse viewpoints. Except primeless viewpoints. I'm not interested in those. <laughs> Thank you for explaining. Okay, steam Do cleaning. Suppose we shall meet again? Jean seems to think the elemental invasion on our beautiful spa is only a minor problem, but this surge of flame and steam needs to be brought under control immediately. We had booked mu musical acts to play in the low area, but the elementals destroyed their gear. As we have never had such levels of elemental destruction in this area before, I suspect primeless influences. If you want to help clear the elementals, if you want to help clear the elementals on the east side of the lower spa, that is where the first events are scheduled. Safe travel. Okay, so to kill elementals, we're gonna find this instructor and some students. What is this bug? Ah, oh, it's a scarab. Uh, he's a musician, and they're just chilling. Okay, what do you got to say, Fifi? You got my ear. We were offered gold to perform on the VIP island. I've never done this before. There were a lot of people, but the other band members left after they realized there isn't even a stage. Some instruments were destroyed by elementals, so I don't blame them for leaving. I'm not sure how much longer I want to wait. It seems like the Serene Dream Spa is anything but serene. Fair enough. And Fairy? Take care of yourself. We'll no have will. a hard time performing without instruments. Haha. <laughs> Maybe I could special I could sing uh Alpaca Pella. Alpacella? Acapella? Uh, you know, on my own. I'm so sad. I wanted to spread cheerful music here. Since everyone is so upset. Especially the undead guy who seems really, really aggressive about his songs. Edward, hey Edward. What are you holding in your hand? Oh, it's a guitar with a <laughs> it looks like a staff. I don't know. A gravestone guitar. 
Things that better be good. I performed in far worse conditions. Well, okay, I've hit things with my guitar in Malay to prevent being eaten. It's the same thing, basically. Remember. Yes. Patience. Very much the same. Scheme scarabs. How are we supposed to get across those weak little gliders? Why are you in this bubble? Do you hear the river song? Please go away. I'm attempting to let the stress fade away. <laughs> hey, it's one of those um guys from Pandaria. Uh, the oh, I forget what these guys are called. The the Jin something, go right? With the walkers. Senjin? Is that who they are? Zeldus. Uh, <laughs> who the heck is Zeldus? Hey Zeldus, who are you? The universe is full I, of mystery. I cannot possibly be seen at the VIP area without my sunglasses. This is a disaster. I had just grabbed a glider and was taking some amazing pictures when I noticed these tiny elementals the size of ants. I thought, huh, ant-sized elementals? What a great photo op. However, when I got there, they were at least three times the size of ants. A muddy one chased me, but like all stylish people, I'm quite fast. I hate to think of what happened to my sunglasses. I guess I'll find some sunnies. Wait. Spa glider instructor. Am I supposed to go somewhere specific? Oh no, no, I'm on the wrong side. Where am I? Where am I supposed to go? Down there? Let's talk to this guy. Do you feel the change? Looking for a glide lesson. Quillis insisted we have gliders for any guests unable to fly on their own. Unfortunately, we must hold off on lessons until the elementals calm down. Without special lessons to use the gliders, you cannot get to VIP Island. Do you have another way to fly up there? I mean, I could Beware use my... The deep places of the earth. I could use my dragon to jump up there, but I don't think I need to get there, right? I need to get down, apparently. Can I get down from this direction? Let's see. I think maybe... Yeah, this is where I want to go. Is there a road down there, or is there not a road down there? There's a road over here. Another big waterfall. How deep dragon that is, man. Is this going to be another thing where I fall down and die? I've got a better idea. Let's not land in the water, let's just aim for the land. Okay, purple plant, and then we'll get rid of this steam skull doer. See, if I add more fire to the steam, you should just evaporate, right? Okay, let's grab this purple plant. Look, it was deep enough. If I jumped in on that side of the bridge, I would have been safe. But if I jumped here, man, I would have been dead again. <laughs> Flame blister. Hey blister. Detonate. No, don't detonate, please. Hey spa guests. Um, what can I do for you? Get out of here. These elementals are ruining my vacation. Where is the manager? He's back up top. Hey, what's this thing down here? Looks like an egg. Now, what is this thing? It's a sack of some sort. Some favorite things. It looks like the Yuga class was interrupted and the students' belongings are scattered everywhere. Collecting these items will certainly aid the Serene Dream Spa. Ah, my quest log is full. I am listening. Okay, let's check my log. While I'm here, I really should pick that quest up. Um.
damn it. Man. Too many quests. Too many quests. What can I do? What can I do? Heroic, mythic. Wait, there's two different Mentoros sigil things? Sigil of Dark Titan. What is this? Collect four sigils of the Dark Titan from Agrimar. Huh? I don't want to abandon those because I don't want to have to. It's not a week. How about we just do some quests and come back and pick this one up? I don't know. Hello. <laughs> Young did always sound funny. I can't relax while getting lit on fire. No, I suppose you can't. Baladash Malinore. Those elementals appeared just as I was about to relax. Hey, Spargist. These elementals are ruining my vacation. What do you say? Where is the manager? Hey, guest. Pleased to meet you. What else do I need to get here? Slay these elementals still. Still need to kill some more of these guys, huh? Oh no! Ooh, almost detonated. Um, hey, what's this big guy in the middle? Mugatu. What is your name? I'm gonna kill you. Come help me, Fire Ellie. Let's punch him. Oh, let's put this toad down, actually, yeah. I should hear myself. Punch him in the face. Heal. Damn it. <laughs> I got distracted. <laughs> uh. I could have killed that guy, huh? I was like, I should put down Cap Toad, but then I click Windrush, and then I was like, what am I doing? Uh. Now everything's on cooldown. I didn't even use um primarily a wave. That would have that would have done it probably. Well three more of these elementals, huh? It's not that guy. It doesn't seem to be these guys. It seems to be these guys up here. Hmm. Is this a guy? Yep, these guys. Well, a dead nigger, huh? Should 
think we're gonna get this guy here. Okay, we're done. Wait, how do we get back up to the, the manager guy? Do you reckon there's a way up from down here? Hmm. I am curious. <laughs> Let's go this way. Let's go up this path over here. So where that guy? Nope, oh, aggroed him. Hey, this does lead all the way there. Cool. I wasn't sure, but it worked out. Serene Dream Spa. We'll hand these in and then we'll go collect the other quest down there. Greetings, one. Okay, the Yugar class. There's Hopefully more. this experience won't tarnish their views. Next one is on Probably me. will. A few of them are looking for the manager. Life Steam cleaning. You. Take care. A good start, but there's still far too many for my liking. We shall do this again soon. What's this guy here? El Zara. A new Belore You there, Torin. Are you semi competent? Do you have your priorities in check? Good. My precious baby is missing. Save her immediately. Be quick about it. She can't fend for herself in these horrible conditions. Find Elzara's baby. Remember the okay. sun well. Is there other quests? We definitely want to pick this luggage up. Can I jump over that waterfall? Nope, I can't. Ah, oh, snap, I'm dead. I'm not dead. <laughs> Where's this luggage again? Okay. Cool. Now let's collect the luggage. It's all here too. A book. Uh, what else have we got? Some kind of table here. Camera. I wonder if I find that guy's glasses. Parasol. Uh, what is this here? Deck chair. Um, is that is that a pillow? What is this? It is a pillow. Huh. Wait, is the hand in? Excuse me. Where's the hand in for that quest? Back up top. Okay. No, let's go find this um this baby first. <laughs> Duck through the middle of these fiery guys. Or aggro them. Wait, where is this kid? Oh here. <laughs> baby. That's literally called baby. <laughs> find my baby. Hey what primeless? Who are these guys? There you are, your bloody assault ends now. <laughs> are you talking to the dog? Wait. <laughs> Kill them both, same with the mutt. Damn, that dog be crazy. Um, what the F? What is up with you, dog? I'm glad you didn't attack me. Um, what is this piece of meat? Surely the spa manager would appreciate it if there wasn't blood everywhere. Cool. Ah, what can we do? What can we do? Hmm. Look at these question marks. Oh, so many question marks on the map for hand ins. Or to, to find people in places. Hmm.
I guess I'll just add another week of Antorus to the list. But like as soon as I hand these quests in, I'll have I'll free up space now. No, let's go. Let's go. Surely this quest, this will still be here, right? Hey, this is the way up over here. Let's go that way. Let's head up here and hand in this quest, and then we'll come back and pick that quest up. What's um? Cliffside circuit. Oh, it's the race dragon. Running race. Maybe don't do that one yet. Ah, we're over here. Okay. That's useful to know. Okay, I'm gonna hand in the possessions. Some favorite things. It is very kind of you to gather these items. We will return them to their owners. Okay, we got we freed up a slot. Okay, now we can go pick up that thing. Let's see, where was it? Over there. Cool, let's just run off. Let's run off from here. Cool, so it's like I rescued the dog and I picked up the scratch at the same time. Surely the spa manager would appreciate Yeah, yeah, I did that. Clean up 10 bits of mess. Clean it up. It kind of just looks like I'm eating it. Kind of. Wait, where is this mess? It's everywhere. I'm gonna kill this, this guy's gonna aggro if I don't kill him. Carefully removing. I need some more. He's over there, but this guy, these guys. <laughs> There's a piece over there, too. I see a ninth piece here. Is there a better ninth piece than that piece? I don't know. Let's see. I've kind of hooked all around here. Surely there's a there's a piece right there. Look at this guy. Springs heater. Okay, I'm gonna punch you with this fist. Bam, die. Oh, there's a piece right here. Any other pieces over this direction? Nah, no, let's just grab this one guy. Stormkeeper's face. And some more Stormkeepering. That's it. Last piece. Nice. Okay, so now we can hand in. Yes. Okay, let's get back up. Over these flames. Let's go. Where'd that guy?
Here you go. Glory to the Sindori. Alzara ignores you and looks at baby. Are you safe, my precious cuddle muffin? Did the Primalists bleed on you? How dare they? <laughs> As Alzara notices you. I shall definitely be raiding the spa at one star. I expect a blood free experience. Why are you Salama telling me that? Hello. Okay, uh, how about this blood there I cleaned no up? Hurry. <laughs> Look at the bones. I do not want to know, do I? <laughs> not really. Um, enforced relaxation. See you in your dreams. Those primalists that you saw certainly do not seem like the leadership type to me. Who, who would be afraid of a little dog? Huh. So if they mention Vadne, that that sounds like their leader. She must be the one bringing the, in these elementals. We need to get rid of the summoner. They must be close by to the, be causing such trouble. Check the cave directly under us. I know it is where some of the less diligent employees like to take an extended break. <laughs> May your life so long. the summoner is in your cave, your break room. Directly below us, okay. Can do. Head to this cave now. When you say underneath us. Oh, right there. Okay, I see. Let's get up here. Press the wind into the cave. I'm just gonna punch this guy. Put a totem down. But I will also punch you in the face. Boom. What the hell? I'll summon a fire early too then, huh? Hey, the Ellie disappeared when I killed her. Yeah, how about that? The elementals will not rest till your spa has paid in blood. Why? Why do we have to pay in blood? Hmm. Okay, well, let's head back up the road again. Hey, stay away. Ah, come on. Let's exact through these guys. Come on. Come on. Okay, I took well care of her. Farewell. I'm glad this will finally start to get better. We all deserve a little bit of downtime. I hope you find a short respite here as well. You have earned it, Chabu. We shall do this again soon. No worries. Um. Okay, let's just hearth back to this inn in the dragon. I take a break, actually. Yep. Oh damn, this crazy corruption. Let's stand here so when I come back in, I don't have it. Man. It's worn off. Yeah, there it goes. We're done. <laughs>